<laughs> Let's go! Exercise, look at this. My shirt is getting too tight. I can't wear that anyway. Eh? <laughs> I'm gonna have to lose some weight. In fact, that gives me an excuse. I've never been outside doing wildlife uh, filming for a long time due to business uh, ventures and whatever. So, looks like I'm gonna have to lose some weight. Look at that, it's bursting. I owned the bot, I owned the bot that last year. Anyway, I'm, I'm gonna, I think I, I'll start today. Let's go. <laughs> God, I'll need to have a look to see what else is uh, too tight. This is a good shirt, I only wore it about maybe half a dozen times. Oh well, I'll need to go and buy a bigger one, either that or lose a lot of weight. So let's go. <laughs> under a big tree I've come under here for camouflage because there's a flock of field fares which I was actually looking for the uh, day before yesterday so seemingly they, they hadn't arrived then but they've arrived today so I'm gonna try and film a couple of them I know it's, they're a great distance away but if I sit under here pretty quiet I might get a shot of them for my reference photos and for my film bank show you my surroundings 
and the fuel fares are in that tree there. I'm zooming in let you see that tree. That one there. The rest in there in that tree just now at the top. So let's see what I can get. This is what I love about the autumn. <laughs> uh, everything happens in the autumn. Autumn and springtime, as I said to you in a previous vlog, is my favourite time. I don't know if you can hear, but you can, I, you can hear the chittering of the fuel fares all over, all surrounding me. Obviously, they've just arrived. But that's the tree there that the buzzard's in, so. <laughs> Let's see what he's up to. He's just arrived as well. Nice, interesting. I don't know if fuel fares arrived. Field fares arrive in the UK from Scandinavia and Europe just to feed off the bottom fruits and berries. This is a monopod I'm using so it's not exactly steady but it does if you have nothing else. Lovely. Eh? It's a bit shaky but you can see them. I need it to die sometime. <sighs> See if there's any, any of them on the, on the grass there. Lovely. <laughs> it's not very often you get to see field fairs once a year. The sun's coming out as well. interesting, I want to see what that buzzard does, he's maybe watching me, maybe that's what the curiosity is. As you can see guys, I couldn't wait to get the paints and paper out to do my painting of the fuel fairs I had just filmed and seen today. Later on, I'll add the blue sky and I'll give it an autumn feeling by adding the autumn coloured leaves. For this painting, I'm using Faber Castell pencils and watercolour paint. I'm so lucky, guys, living in an area where there's an abundance of wildlife, especially for an artist like me. Right guys, as you can see here, I've sold quite a few paintings over the past couple of days. So I managed to film a couple of them. I think I sold 10 all together. But here's some that I filmed.
If you ever want to purchase any of my paintings or items in my eBay shop, the link is in the description box below. And as I am now out getting more new uh, ideas for my paintings, I'm getting more reference and film of wildlife in my area. So I'll be able to paint and draw some fresh new paintings to supply my EV shop. So I'm looking forward to that as well. So. Shave time. <laughs> All clean and shaved. Magic. Right, let's get on to the next piece of the vlog. How clean that does that look? Uh, I'll cut the next here and there, but I'll put some cream on it. Nice, eh? Next. <laughs>
Superb. I might have two. <laughs> Hi guys, it's minus three today. <laughs> a bit chilly, so I might uh, do a bit of painting this afternoon. Do some wildlife. I've got some nice wildlife uh, reference photos and film that I took the other day, as you've probably seen. If not, it'll be coming soon. But I think I think it's in a vlog you've seen uh, before this one. So yeah, minus three today. <laughs> it'll be one of the coldest days we've had this year. But we are in uh, November now, so it's got to, it's to be expected. <laughs> anyway, I'm having a nice brisk walk as I do most days. Train going by. Uh, most days I have a nice brisk walk so keep the heart pumping so I'm going to finish my walk here and go and do some painting or uh, listing new paintings for eBay. Catch you a bit. Look at this. I'll show you down here. Look at the ice. Anyway, I'll show you where I'm at. Lovely scenery before I go. Cathedral up there. <laughs> Got to watch my, my my foot in here as you've seen there. Icy, icy. I don't want to break another ankle. I've done that once before. Anyway, let's go on to the next bit of the vlog. Minus three outside guys, it's very chilly. Right guys, I just received this parcel from uh, the Royal Mail. It's from the Royal Mint as well, so let's have a look at my monthly coin. Let's take it then to my living room. Into the dark. More light in here, you see, guys. Open it up. The Great British, what's that? Banknote collection. Oh, look at these. Look at these lovely. That looks like it's made out of copper. Or the usual razzmatazz there. Let's have a look at this. Get some light. There you are. It's Harry Eccleston. It's like uh, plates for a banknote. They're shiny as anything. That's I'm trying to get the light, guys. Yeah, that's better. They're on copper plate, but they're like pound notes, front and reverse, so it's like plates for uh, printing off pound pound notes, so I'm pleased with that. So it's not actually a coin, it's a bloody minted plate. That's great. Lovely, eh? 
<laughs> That'll go with, with my collection. I get one every month if I want, if I choose choose to get one. Yeah, I'm here late. I should have had the blind up the first place, but I usually get one of these per month and I put it by to for investment reasons, you know what I mean? They're only gonna get in value after all. <laughs> uh, and it comes for the real mint. So I'm happy. Let's get on with today's vlog. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that vlog. It's a bit different for the last ones, isn't it? I'm back into the wildlife filming, so it's the next morning after that. So, as I says, I hope you enjoyed that vlog, and I hope to be going out to film more wildlife for you. And this morning, the past couple of days has been minus three, as I've been saying to you, but this morning it is minus five. So I'll have a wee look before I clock off, guys. This morning, it's a beautiful morning, sunset, sun sunrise, sorry, and I'm going to go back out and see what I can get. Uh, wildlife filming, I know there's a road here at the start of the path going into the forest, so I think I'm going to try and film him today because as I've experienced in previous frosty days, the deer come out. So. Anyway, so the boiling calm and sign off. So until the next time, I'm going to say bye bye for now, and I hope you enjoyed that vlog there. Bye bye. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it. <laughs>